Back to NBC 3 News at six. In another country, well, each year, 35 students from across the globe come to central New York and parts of Pennsylvania to find out. The Cortland District is part of the International Student Exchange Program, a nonprofit started back in 1982. Students from across the world, ages 15 to 18, have the chance to live in another country with a host family and learn more about what it's like to live in the States. New at 6, I'm Mary Keeler introduces us to two students who had this chance of a lifetime and tell us they have different thoughts about the U.S. after living here. Meet Haley and Hector. She's from Da Nang City, Vietnam. He's from Chihuahua, Mexico. For the past year, they've been exchange students at Cortland High School. Hector says he had some preconceived notions about Americans. We think that Americans, they are like very, how I say, like they don't have emotions, like very cold. You can say that. Haley says she couldn't wait to show people what it's like to be Vietnamese. First thing that we want to be in America is I want to share about the culture of Vietnam. The two live with their host family, go to school, travel, and do community service. And they're taking in the news on school safety and immigration. I was a little scared when I first came because I was like, Maybe people, it's going to be mean because I'm Mexican or something, but here in Cortland, the people has been so kind with me. He's glad he could provide some real perspective for those who had questions. One time that people were like, wait, do you drive cars like normal ca cars? And I was like, no, we're riding in horses to a school and stuff. And they were like, wait, for real? And I'm like, no, I'm kidding. <laughs> Haley says security at school stands out to her and the fact that so many lockdown and lockout drills happen. She says she's taking action when she gets home. I want to write a letter for like the education government in Vietnam because like I want to make people know that how special America thinks student is, how they want to take care of their life. Both are bringing back new insight and appreciation for the U.S., learning from each other, too. He, I remember when he, when he said with me that in Charlotte, every little, little second you live here. Making this big world seem smaller and kinder. In Cortland, I'm Mary Keeler reporting. Well, they represent themselves and their country as well, don't they?